You see, most of the time when I talk about investments, some of the people tend to think like I usually talk about humongous amount of money, okay? And you have to have like hundreds of thousands or even millions for you to be to invest. And I know what, let me tell you one secret, even with as low as 100 Kenyan shillings, that is exactly the topic of today, with as low as 100 Kenyan shillings, that's less than a dollar, you can actually invest into these areas which I usually talk about, okay? Now, the point is this, I know you are out there and you always think like, hey, guess what, I love your videos and I guess what, I love what you usually do here, Joseph, you always watch me and today I'm going to give you a challenge. Stop just watching me and then liking my videos and also commenting down below and you're not taking any action, all right? You're supposed to watch and then after watching, getting the information, then go out there and invest. I'm going to give you a challenge. If you just keep on watching me, that does not make any difference in your life. It's like saying, hey, it's like watching motivational videos, going to the gym, losing weight and what have you, but you're not taking any action. Taking action is when after watching the video, after watching that very inspiring kind of a, you know, sort of a video or watching that very logical video that you can actually borrow some things and you invest and get a difference in your life. Going beyond that now, taking the action and actualizing that what you've learned. If you keep on watching me, watching me, you're not taking any action. You're still, you're still saying, hey, I'm waiting for a time whereby I get, you know, enough money for me to, that will never work. I always tell people, you can start with as low as 100 Kenyan shillings, you can start with 500. By the way, are you aware that there are some shares you can buy with less than 500 Kenyan shillings? 1,000, 2,000, 3,000, 5,000, 10, 100, whatever the amount, amount of money, all the way, say, from 100 Kenyan shillings all the way to millions of money, you can actually invest. So pick yourself in between from the lowest to the highest. Pick yourself. Where do you find yourself? Get started. There was a time I dedicated a whole of a video and I told you guys, hey, there are some of the money market fund. <clears throat> You can invest with as low as 100 Kenyan shillings. You can check that previous video that I did make and you can actually go ahead and start doing something. So the problem that I usually find with the people is this. Most of the people are visionaries. They, you just have the visions, you are motivated. You know, it's like, I do remember back when we, when we were in high school and then teachers, um, uh, before we used to sit, before we sit for our, you know, uh, exams, we used to, you know, there's some guys who used to come and talk to us, give us the motivations and you can see even the jokers with a pen and paper. <clears throat> excuse me pen and paper writing all the uh, whatever that's being said in that seminar and what have you shaking their heads you know agreeing with everything that is being said they're saying oh yeah sure mm, amazing ah oh, yeah mm -hmm. um th th that's that's really true you see i had a friend like that one but anyway after two three days you forgot what was taught and then you're out there and you still go back to the same thing and that's why you find most of the people who are successful in life you find that actually they fall under what we call let's say less than two percent okay have you asked yourself why less than two percent you know, but 98% of the people, 98% of the population, you know what they are? They're just average. They're just average. Some of them, I'm telling you, they are jokers, okay? Others, do you know what they are? They are ignorance, you know? Ignorance. People who, they are like, whenever you tell them something, they ask you, okay, fine, you're telling me that. What have you done yourself? What have you invested? If you were to rely on those ideas that you gave us, you'll be a billionaire or something of sort. So, okay, fine. If I have the idea, so should I not share or something of sort? You're ignorant. So, you're supposed to understand yourself. Out of the 98%, what category are you? You're just an average? You know, there are people who are just okay with following people. Yeah, it's true. There are people who are just okay with like, okay, fire. I, I, there's some there's some guys whom I was uh, sharing some ideas about investment. Then they told me, I don't like investing. I don't love businesses. I just love to be employed. You know, I, I asked them why. I, I just love it that way. I don't like that hustling and whatever. And I was like, okay, fine. That's your personality. That's what you choose. But the reality is, anyway, uh, you have to, if you're this kind of a guy who feel like you are not settled with that what you get, you always aspire to get more. Then take action. Let's say maybe you are just a simple company one inch in our country you do your vibarua maybe you're doing the, the the construction industry we call it mjengo here in kenya or maybe you are mama bonga when i say mama bonga i mean like these guys who hook things and what have you like the lowest guys in our society somebody who is earning maybe let's say from uh, 300 kenyan shillings in a day all the way to um let's talk of a thousand bob okay or let's say 1,500, okay? So if you fall under this category in Kenya, you're regarded as a common monainchi out there. So if this is the range of your salary or range of your income, 
you can always do it. Can you imagine this? I shared an example of money market fund that you can actually be investing 100 bob each and every day. You can give yourself a challenge over that. So if let's say maybe you earn like a 500 Kenyan shillings, okay? 500 Kenyan shillings. You can decide to try as much as you can survive on the 400 and then the 100 that is remaining, you actually channel it towards what? Towards an investment. Let me tell you one secret. I know you'll be like, okay, fine. The cost of living is very high. I cannot be able to salvage on what I can be able to invest. I have not underplaying the fact that the cost of living can is very high it is very high and that's for sure and so that's very true and it's also true that we also need to do something for the sake of our lives for the sake of our investment so that at least we can progress to the next level because there is no any other way that we can be able to do apart from this one so what's my point my point is this you can invest as low as 100 kenyan shillings and i said if you'd like to get more information on this go check my previous video where i talked about some of the examples of the money market fund that you can invest on this and let me get, get give you a very let me just give you a very simple analogy where how life happens okay this is the point you find like most of the people yes they are visionaries they have the visions they aspire they love to do something for example if i pull a mic and go to the street and start asking people questions and asking them hey do you have any vision about your life everybody would say yes i do have a vision everybody would say yes i do have a rare will you get, rarely will you get an individual saying hey, i don't have any vision i don't have any goal i'm just okay i'm just moving with the vibe i'm not saying that you cannot get such you can but most of the people will tell you they have the visions. There is no problem. And that's why you find the range of success. Uh, you know, we shall say they, 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 we say those steps. The very first step, everyone has the, the vision. And then when you ask them, what's the vision? Yes, I do. My vision is to start this business. Or my vision is to buy this item. Or my vision is to, by the time I'm retiring, by the time I'm for in three years' time, in ten years' time, everybody has the vision. And then you ask them, how much will it cost to start that vision? Everybody knows, hey, guess what? For me to buy a piece of land and build my own home or maybe rentals, if that's my vision, requires me to have like five million on six million. They know very much. And then when you tell them, okay, fine. Since morning until now, what have you done that is actually propagating you towards a Achieving that vision, uh, they start scratching their head and tell you uh, how, whatever. There was a certain person whom I uh, I did approach, and uh, he told me he would like to be one day be a corporate or maybe a CEO or something of sort. And then I asked that individual, okay, fine, that's not that, that's not wrong, that's amazing. Then what did you do today that actually? moved you a step closer to you being a vision or rather being a that CEO or corporate. And he told me nothing. I haven't done anything since then. Then you're saying that is just a vision. Okay. That's just a goal that you are not even doing anything towards you achieving it. You see, let me tell you one secret. If my vision I as Joseph is to one day have a very big show where I'll be hosting people, saying, you know, helping people in terms of the finance investments and what have you, I have to start by me standing before a camera like this one, recording a video and letting people know who I am. I progressively grow my channel to a point where by now I can have a very big platform. Somebody's like uh, Dave Ramsey, you know, those like Steve Graham or something of sort. So those great people are that I usually follow and I aspire very much in my life. So if you ask me if that is my vision, then you ask me, what did you do today? Well, I did stand before a camera and recorded a video and I said this and this and this. And then that's what exactly I did. Now, if you are out there, you're aiming one day to do this. You want one day to uh, be earning money passively. You are not investing. You have not taken any action. You only watch me. I talk about shares. You smile. You give me a like. You like the video. You comment down below. You do nothing. I come again. I talk about treasury bonds. You do nothing. You don't invest. I talk about trades. You do, just watch. You get, just be happy. You do nothing. Let me tell you one secret. All what you do is that by the time you realize the 50 years will be here, the 60 years will be here, and now you'll turn back to be a motivational speaker. You'll be talking to young guys, telling them, hey, you know what, guys, you're supposed to take action and all those kind of things. Take action. That's what, that's what differentiates between a person A and person B. So that's the challenge that I'm going to leave you with you today. And always try the best that you can. Don't just consume the information. Consume, assimilate, and actually put them into the actions. That's what brings the difference. And there was a time I used to, and I still do, read a lot of books as far as the finance are concerned self-improvement and what have you but i don't like fully rely on the information and i feel like by virtue of me reading a book then i'm okay everything is good my bank account will show up no 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 I differentiate between me learning or reading the book, getting the information and actually exercising that what I get from the books so that at least I'd be able to progress to the next one. For example, right now before I did make this video, I wasn't feeling like I'm making, I wasn't feeling like I want to make this video. I was like, I can just relax today because I feel like I'm so tired. And But I remember, hey, guess what? 
discipline is doing things that you know you ought to do them not because you're feeling like you want to do them you just do them and that's why i always tell people there should be no aborting day to a man every time you wake up you should do something about your life that, that's for a fact even if you don't feel it and, and and if you were to rely on our feelings i am telling you most of the things will be halted nothing will be going on as far as if you were to rely on our emotions rely on our discipline take actions and progress to the next level and i'm gonna leave you this challenge if you want to make a difference in your life don't just watch my videos don't just watch my videos this won't make you rich this won't bring any difference in your bank account this won't get yourself out of the broke life take action after you watch me after you watch my videos after you identify some of the things that you can actually incorporate in your life take action do that and i always tell people if you get confused in between pick my number my number is always on the description of this specific video pick that number come at a personal level talk to me i offer those services obviously at a cup of coffee price okay talk to me let's talk about uh, investments okay and, and, and that's way that's the only way that you actually assure yourself hey I'm actually doing that's what is important. I'm actually doing that's what is required so that at least I can make a difference in my life. So anyway, what's my last point? Make sure that you pick my number from the description of this specific video. Shoot me a call or text me on WhatsApp. Let's progress. And again, don't forget to subscribe. And I know you ask yourself, okay, what's the importance of that? The importance of that is that whenever I upload a new good video, you'll be notified by YouTube every time I upload it, okay? And make sure that you like this video. And by the way, those two things that I've told you to do doesn't cost you nothing. It's just free of charge. Liking this video, sharing this information with you for free. Like this video, comment down below, tell me what you think, okay? And I've been watching videos. And by the way, you've been watching my videos and you've taken any action. Let me know in the comment section. For now, it's a goodbye and see you in the next one.